Hello, I'm Paul Holt, CEO of Class On Demand. Class On Demand creates the best training in the world for digital content creators. What you're about to see is a segment from a complete tutorial. When it's over, I'll tell you how you can purchase the complete training at a discounted price. So enjoy today's free lesson, and I'll see you again soon. Let's go ahead and make a little role title. Now, I just happen to have, if I minimize this, I've got a little text piece that I've done in WordPad, and I'm going to open that up. Now here's the other thing that's important. You can cut and paste text from any available source, whether this be from the web, from any uh, word processing program that you might have. What I've done is I've selected all of them. I'm going to do a control C, which is copy. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go back to studio and we're going to do a control V. That'll paste this all in here. And now you can see we've got this neat little roll page. Let's go ahead and save this. We'll close this, and you'll now see that you have this little roll page over this. Let's go ahead and show that to you real quick. All right, now what we want to do is notice how it cut off there at the end? The reason for that is because we want to leave a couple of blank lines at the end. So what we're going to do is go right to the end here right after game just click and then hit enter a bunch of times until it's off the screen let's go ahead and save that and now it should be updated and now what it'll do is it'll go off the edge of the screen you see how it goes off before it ends now this looks pretty neat if you want to slow that down make it longer there we go Pretty neat. Okay, so that's how you do a roll page. What I want to do is go in here and double click on it. And we'll delete this one. Do a control X. It'll keep all my text because I'm just cutting it out now. I'm going to do a crawl page. Notice how it gives you an idea of where you're at. If you forget what type of a page you're on, it says so right up here. Let's click in there and do a control V again. And even though it looks like a roll page, it's not. It's just showing you everything that's going to crawl. So let's go ahead, close this down. There we go. Now, you notice that it crawled along the top of the page. If you go in here to your justify, it was in the upper left corner. If we go down here, put it down in the bottom left corner, now you'll see that it'll be at the bottom. And the re see how it's jumping here a little bit? This is what we were talking about before about rendering. It's really important that you let this thing render out so you can actually see what it looks like. Because it was kind of stuttering there. All right, now we're ready to go. Terrific. So that's how you do a crawl page. Hello again. So if you found this lesson valuable, imagine what you could learn from the entire training. So please visit our website at classondemand.net to order the training and also to view our entire product catalog. When you're checking out, enter the product code below for a 10% discount. It's that simple. So once again, on behalf of Class On Demand, I'm Paul Holtz. Thanks for watching.